Colbert have been concerned about this intersection for a while. There have been a number of crashes there in the last few months alone, and you can see why if you take a look here, the highway and this regular street right here running exactly perpendicular to each other. And I went out there tonight and I too actually almost got in an accident. I was sitting right here on Colbert Road trying to make a left turn onto this highway, which means I had to go get out into this median part here. Well, I'll tell you, going from a full stop position to try to go across highway speed traffic is not fun. So anyway, there's a school nearby as well, and that got a number of parents concerned. Together, they created a petition. People in the area asked for one of three changes, a signal, a roundabout, or a lower speed limit. Well, today, WashDOT met with them. More than 100 people showed up despite the nasty weather, and WashDOT basically told them that those three options aren't viable. A signal there, they said, would only cause different safety issues. A roundabout is too expensive and not even that popular in the community, and a lower speed limit. Well, they said evidence shows it just doesn't work. And this got mixed reactions from the people in the room. Here's how some of that conversation played out. I've driven this road since 1994. The intersection is dangerous. You guys could go out tomorrow and change the speed limit, and I know you don't want to, but that's what we're all asking you to do. Just to arbitrarily lower a speed limit, and I'm not saying that's not out of the question up here, but it doesn't make a lot of sense right now. We need more enforcement out there. We can come out and we could talk to people and tell them about the rules of the road. We can have emphasis in education, but the rules of the road work. I don't want to sound like go away just having heard all the things we can't do and not have any movement forward from here. Moving forward. Now, in terms of moving forward, there were a couple low-cost options on the table, but most of those involve restricting what you can do at this intersection, and that wasn't something everyone wanted. So, clearly, it's a complicated issue and one that's going to still take more time before it really gets resolved. Mark, Whitney?